Right, it's now Sunday morning. And, uh, and this is what we've woken up to. And I can't say it's too bad. Right, this is where we slept last night. I'm in this little spot here in the Old Green Valley, opposite P O M, and um, I just come back here. Anna bought me um, a cheese and onion pasty about an hour ago. We've just come back here. I've just bought another one. They're bloody gorgeous. But the plan today is we're going to go and do Igam. Right, it's Sunday, August the thirtieth, and today we're going to go up Igam via this way. Hoping to get up there before dark. Trifan, glitter fat, glitter flower, and your garden is up there. Lovely day. I'll go and climb a mountain. Well, nothing else to do around it. Oh, cracking day. He's a river, this Mickey. He just says to Anna, right, this bit's a bit steep, do you, get on, do you want to get on my back? She goes, yeah, okay. So I look at him and say, what, are you serious? He goes, yeah. I actually believed him. Honestly. You didn't actually agree to that, by the way, but I'm just hypothesizing. H Y P. I'm just having my Egan moment. It's gonna be good actually, good doing this again because although I've done it, I've not done it from this route. So it's good. Oh, yeah, that's it. I mean, I can keep adding up the numbers for Snowden, and yeah, that's great. But then, 
it's also nice just to come and see different parts and explore different routes. This is all right, it's all right, and it's not too difficult either. Searching here, not a scree, it's steep. This is like going up, here, um, it's like going up clear the fowl. I'm going to go and knock out some mountains over there. Yeah, this is tough, this bit. Very tough on the backs of your legs. I've done this. So I'm now going to leave the summit of Igarn and I'm going to head over to Falgok and over to right over there. I'm going to come out with this scree before. A couple of zigzaggy up the scree. Just thing down there, there's a couple of horses. That's something I've never seen on the mountain before. And then that one over there is called Minid Perfect. And then I'm going to try and get to that one row at the top.
there's a new one. Right, let's head off for my second summit of the day. Bolgok. Where's this come from? Up there. Gone. You waited till my back was turned before you did that, didn't you? Ugh. Look at the hill, this one. What are the odds? There'll be someone here. Let's take the picture. You too, mate. Thanks for the pictures. See ya. Right, so. Right, off we go. It was 15 minutes coming up this, so 10 probably going down. I'm running out of batteries as well, so I'm going to have to change my battery. Right, I'm leaving Fal. Fal. Rock. Fal. Got at 1.36. And that's the goal at 1. So it's took me 36 minutes to do this bit and. Come on. I remember coming up this, it's horrible. This steep coming down. I'm glad I ain't got to come back up this. Coming down this scree. I'll tell you, I'm going to be coming down it. Oh, this does kill me, folks. Long way, Mick. Left, it goes to the end of the flower. You go right, it's where I'm going. Just take you to mine it perfect. Got a flow coming up here. It was tough, it was worth it. There's a hole in the fence here, a star. What do you reckon I'm gonna do?
this though. It's 821 meters. This one here is 812. That's high. Oh, yeah, it is high. You can see it. So, Conard E. Filias. That's where I'm going. And that'll be my final thing that I do today. I'm really glad I've come and done this one. Right, head off to the last one. It's 2 and 4 and I've just left uh, Manet Perfect which means it's been 1 hour and 3 minutes since I left the garden. And then that time I've done Tol Gomp and this one in an hour. That's not bad. So that's the area and then one in the middle. to get a few of those in here. Well, this walk up to Carnage is for is actually just a grassy walk. Nothing tough about it at all, but I tell you what, look at this poor visibility. It's really nice. I'll appreciate them coming back. You know, but I know I'm just heading forward. Western tip of the Glitteroo Mountains. Okay, this is the point where we play the game of guess which rock to lose. Is it for a view? It's 2.23 past now, I'm going to leave here, 
I'm gonna head back. My day's done. Right, so that's that one done. Right, I'm leaving Murnid Perfect. Now I've got to make my way all the way back up to Egon. Yeah, it's been really good doing this today. Glad I've come out and made the effort. 2.56, and I'm going on the trek up to Egon. I've just gone past the stile where you go up to Falgok. So, last time I was here, so I went on up there. So I've never actually been up this track, so now I am. First time on this one. Oh, heading up here. Really pleased. This trip has had four days, two days rain, two days sun, uh, 13 summits. Long lonely climb coming up this scree. Oh, it zigzags a bit there. That's the summit. And that's where I've got to get to. 328. So it's taking 32 minutes to get there, to get up. Hell, but get down. Oh, I said I wanted to do it in an hour. So by doing it in 32 minutes, I'd say it was a success, wouldn't you? That was tough on the knees. Find a path again. So it's just over here. I'm going to come all the way over there. And that one, that one, and that one. Coming up these. Oh, oh, it's like a roller coaster. Look. <laughs> oh. Move. This is tough. This bit. This is exactly where. Last time I saw them. I'm going to put the camera away because this is pretty tricky. Be ended up getting down in less than two hours, if you know what I mean. And I think you do! I'll tell you what, that's hairy coming down there. You've really got to have your wits about you. you have your brakes on, on your boots. Much quicker coming down though than it was going up. That going up was an absolute nightmare. Oh, I just had a real feel good moment. I'm coming down. Basically, not stocking. I've got to the point where I just okay, I'm here and I need a drink. And I'm thinking the only thing I've got is one can of Pepsi Max cherry, that's all I've got. So I was just going through my bag and I found this, and then I was thinking that's empty. It's not, it's full. Oh. Uh, it's been a good day out, but in reality, it's pretty much only half a day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. It's 4 14. Oh, yeah, that's not bad at all. And I'm just finishing. Yeah, my feet. Oh, really, uh, was here earlier. We were uh, all having a discussion about hairy vaginas. Yes. I'm sitting on a rock near sunset in a really lovely location under Egan, Trifan and Penny Oloren listening to the Pet Shop Boys well not just listening to it but singing and shouting along to it life is good <laughs> 